Today I'm going to show you how to make an apple and blackberry crumble. For the filling you will need 400 grams of apples, 50 grams of sugar, either demerara or caster sugar, 200 grams of blackberries and a tablespoon of plain flour. Firstly you want to peel and dice your apples. Then to your apples you want to add your sugar, your blackberries and your plain flour and give this a really good mix until it's all really well combined. Then to the bottom of a oven proof dish, mine was 27 centimeters by 19 centimeters. You just want to add your filling um, and you want to press it down on your filling. This helps keep the crumble on top. Um, if you don't press down, it leaves space for the crumble to fall through. So by pressing down, it means that your crumble has a nice even layer on top that it should stay. I also tried to distribute my um, blackberries a little bit better. Then for your crumble top, you will need 150 grams of plain flour, 100 grams of cast sugar, and 100 grams of butter. In a separate bowl, to your flour, add your cast sugar and give it a really good mix. Then add your butter. I've cubed my butter to make it a little bit easier. And with the tips of your fingertips, you just want to press your butter into your flour sugar mix. And you want to press it until it starts to resemble breadcrumbs and it's like a nice crumble mix. Then simply add this to the top of your filling, spreading it out and making sure it's as even as possible. Then you want to bake this in a preheated oven at gas mark 5, 190 degrees centigrade or 170 fan assisted for 45 to 55 minutes until the top is really crispy and golden. And there you have it. That's how you make an apple and blackberry crumble.